Hello and welcome to this video on how to test Honeywell Notify. If you've got your key, whack it in onto the unlock position. If not, if you open the panel, you'll see where it's connected to. Disconnect it and link it out. Here on the menu, if you can see a menu there, it will quite happy. You just go onto it. If not, you have to push this button to move across to the tab. If you go down to the second one there, which is tests, go into tests and select what you want to test. In this case, it's obviously going to be zones. And tick to put whichever ones you want into tests, going down and ticking whichever one you want. I'm going to put them all in test for now. Once you're happy, you can see your test lights on in the bottom left hand corner. If I move the key, it'll take you back. Here you see a menu which tells you which has been tested. It's quite handy for this system. Oh, so I forgot, uh, if you wanted this as it stands now, we'll test with sounders. If you want to disable the sounders, put your key back in and hit disable alarms. It, it does change color, you can't really tell in this video, but it does light up. And you get your disabled light there on the bottom as well. Uh, this feed, this system has a really cool feature, which is this uh, green flashing light you can see here. So any device is not tested, we'll have a green light. Once it's tested, that green light will stop flashing, as you'll see in a minute. So if I just trigger this now, red light symbolizes that it's been active and received by the panel. Come out, and your green light has now disappeared. All the other devices on the system will still have a green light as I walk around. You can test multiple uh, devices at once on this system, which is quite handy because of the light test system. So that's all tested now. As you can see, now we've got one that's showing us tested and 37 still to test. As you can see here, it's showing that that device number 39 has been tested. So we flack our key back in then. We turn our sounders back on by simply pressing the uh, disable alarm button. That removes your disable light and your alarm disable light. Uh, here you've got your tabs, like I explained earlier. Press that across to go to menu and down to start and then test. Tick into zones because it was zones we tested. And just go down and tick them all to put them back to normal. Once that's done, you can press exit or just simply remove the key. As you can see, it has gone back to a blank screen. That's it. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe.